something else which you have to do and then we'll be gauging your reception is reading a story. So you have to decide which one of you three will be reading the story. First of all, Nandra, to decide. Not me. My director is saying, Awiti asome, awiti asome. Ha, sauti ya mudi. Yeah, mina takatupena asome. Story again. Itakuwa hapa kwa otoki utaisoma tu. Gosh. What? Jugush, jugush soma. <laughs> okay, yeah. are we to take the story yeah. then? Yeah. Um, please look at camera two, that's that one over mm -hmm. there. Um, and then what you do is introduce yourself, tell us why you're here, and then read the story. <clears throat> Okay, my name is Awini Anyango and you are watching Friday Briefing. We are here to represent the real house, house elves of Kawangware. Okay, back to the story on a very serious note. A 62-year-old man from Muranga County has, been, has confessed that he defiled up and possibly impregnated his 16-year-old daughter, forcing her to drop out of school. The man, however, claims that the devil is to blame for his actions. Njama Ismail brings you the story. This turn of events has left residents of Kimbirwa village in Muranga in total disbelief. This young girl no longer attends classes at the Mirita Primary School because she's four months pregnant. The man accused of putting the 16-year-old child in the family way is her own 62-year-old father. <laughs> Ya tare, tare saba, waine. The girl's condition became public after teachers at her school noticed she was withdrawn and missed some of her classes. They suspected she might be pregnant. He said that she was not pregnant. So uh, the headmaster reported the case to the assistant chief. And the assistant chief called, uh, called the parents to his office. They did, not go to, they did not go there. A contingent of officers from the area administrator's office would later descend on the man's home to demand answers. Katika mila sub location, mambo kama haya. Ya mtoto kulala na baba yake. Si jao hikuona. Chagu ni andiko na sasa ni kona kalibu almost 80 years. Kwa hivyo, hii ni kitado kwanza ni meona ya kwangu na diyo ya kwanza. Lessons continue at Merida Primary School, but the Standard 7 girl now has to drop out to focus, at least for a while. The man has blamed the devil for making him commit the act. Saitani, Saitani, ata risida mtu anaito Daudi, na kafanya kitendo hicho, na wakati ya lireto nini ya kamba musama, na mungu waka musame. Ata mimi naomba. This girl's younger siblings now watch as their father is taken away to the Muranga police station to answer to charges of defilement.